Hello everybody, it's uh, Robbie here again, just down at the wharf, the wind's blowing pretty hard uh, northwest there, didn't think it was supposed to blow that hard but it's blowing 20, 20, 25 knots maybe, gust of 25, hopefully the wind dies out here this evening, anyway I just thought I'd uh, come down and make a video, I uh, got something unusual today in the trap. We were hauling a, <coughs> a bunch and uh, just off the harbor here in 20 feet of water. I think it was the, probably the second trap to come in. Anyway, uh, I run the hauler. So I was running this and wasn't paying much attention. And next thing Bob's all worked up. What the hell's going on? Anyway, this is what it was. Blue lobster. Huh? I've seen them before, but I never got one. In 14 years, I was always kind of wishing I'd, you know, someday catch one. And today was the day. Pretty neat, huh? I don't know what the. It's like one in four million or something crazy. Has this, uh. I got some kind of a pig, pig, it's some kind of a disease, or not a disease, but it's whatever they have, they, it's like a albino or something. Anyway, he's, there's what he's supposed to look like. <laughs> Neat, eh? He's kind of whitish under, underneath, female, just, uh, He's a large canner, he's pretty near a market. Anyway, when Bob pulled him out, it's uh it was just first glance, I said he'd probably be a short or spawn or something, we'll have to throw him back. Hey, it'll be So that's uh that's the first. About ten years ago I got one and it was uh a bright orange, the same, you know, sometimes they're orange. I guess sometimes they can be white. I've seen them down the middle before be uh, maybe blue on this side of their body and normal color on this side or be orange on this side and you know it's a it's a rare thing I've seen uh, seen them in tanks and stuff before you know every year there's probably there's I don't know eight or ten lobsters here in the island that are caught, that are blue. Sometimes they're real light blue. This one's pretty dark. He's got a little purplish tint to the end of his claw. Eh? Anyway, he's he's a uh, different. So uh, yeah. So we uh, so what are we gonna name him? We got in. We so we got a name. So we decided to name him Cecil. A buddy of ours fishes down here. His name Cecil. He's a very unique individual. He fishes with his brothers. He's never, never happy. Always bitching and complaining. So he just a one of a. He's one of a kind. So he said, "Well, this lobster's one of a kind too." So Cecil is his name. Anyway, I just thought I'd. Uh, I was pretty excited when <laughs> when we got him. Hello, Cecil. Yeah, I don't. <clears throat> it's been a long time since there was a blue lobster caught at this wharf. I'm thinking somebody thought probably 10 years, 10, 12 years. So it's funny uh, if he's been around in the water here for a while. It's funny nobody ever got him as a short lobster. Or, it's a spawn, you know, female. She's a, fe she's a female. Even though she's a female, we named him Cecil. Just kind of fit him, <laughs> fit her. Cecil's kind of a bitch, so yeah. Same thing. <sighs> so yeah, that's uh, the thought I, I have him in a crate. So I threw him in the crate there today. Went home and charged up my camera and had a little power nap. So I'll have to go back 
down to the harbor and make this video. I know a lot of people have never seen that before. I'll probably never ever catch one again. This is probably the first and last blue lobster that I'll ever get. You never know, right? That's fishing. You just never know what's going to be in your trap. You see my video this year of uh, the one that had the the crazy deformed claw. I took him and got him uh, stuffed at a local taxiderma shop. Anyway, I think what I'm going to do with Cecil here is uh, the place where I sell my oysters uh, over in Stanley Bridge, Cars uh, Lobster Pound. They have a, a big restaurant and attached to the restaurant is an aquarium so they have all kinds of, you know, fish and, you know, different things in there, lobsters, crabs. So, they're probably going to have a blue lobster. So I'm going to let them put the lobster Cecil in the aquarium for the summer and then come fall I guess I'll probably take Cecil to get him stuffed or I might let him go if I let him go I'll take him up the bay let him go up there I don't know I kind of like to stuff him because I'll never get one again right anyway I just thought I'd come down and make this short little video of Cecil the bitch and uh, Brutus there next to him so <laughs> Cecil and Brutus so I'll put them back in their little crate for the night keep them in the water keep them happy sometime over the weekend I'll take them over to the restaurant and put them in the aquarium anyway a lot of people taking pictures of them today there's some tourists around just even the local uh, fishermen you know it doesn't happen every day there's a blue lobster that comes in it's probably like I said 10 years so for now I think Cecil's gonna have a good life until the fall we'll see what I'm gonna do with Cecil anyway just uh, I'm gonna make a little video tomorrow and if it's nice hope that damn wind goes down anyway that's uh, that's everything for now uh, he's a pretty lobster. Like I said, he's a lot darker blue than the ones I've seen before. So, anyway, cheers, everybody. Comment, uh, you know, I like your comments, and uh, please subscribe, subscribe to my channel, and whatnot, and give me a thumbs up. Thanks.